Hello viewers, I'm now going to enter Gardenia's gym. I already beat all of the gym trainers. Basically all you have to do is find the first one, which is located right here. And then she'll tell you where one of the other ones is and then they will keep having over and over until you get the battle. Gardenia. So I'm gonna start battling. You probably wanna start leading off of a flying type. And also, I found out that my Wurmple will evolve into Dust Dox. So I'm going to evolve him soon. The reason I didn't evolve him earlier was because I didn't want to evolve into a beautifly. Well, it isn't a nightmare of him evolving into beautifly. It's just that uh, I like the stocks a bit better. Dirt Wig's coming up. I'm gonna keep battling with Star. I'm just gonna keep battling with Star until Star's end. And we have a Grotto and she has a Turtwig. I already tried to battle Turtwig with Grotto before I started filming, except that it was a really close match and I was pretty sure Grotto it was going to take forever until Grotto was going to lose. Anyways, I was just seeing what Pokemon she had. That, this is one of the only gems I decided to do that. So I could do it on maybe the next gym too, but I won't do that on every single gym. Rocket grew to level 14. Once I want to move Rage. Let's see how good Rage is. It goes attack power every time. I'm gonna replace it for Screech. Every time I'm I'm hit in battle, it'll go on attack power. It's about to send in Rose Ray. I'm probably gonna keep battling versus Rose Ray. And also in Heart Gold, I recently caught Suicune. Off oh, film, it's not the end yet. I can tell by your confidence. I can tell that this could take a while. I'm almost for sure Rose Raid could win. Oh no. Got some type of berry there. Uh, using a citrus berry. I don't want to evolve Wormple yet since Grass Knot gets worse every. worse. to yourself every time. E the heavier Pokemon gets. And I'm pretty sure. And plus, he'd probably be a cast queen. Or say something? You think you have me cornered? All you have to do is actually attack. And then you're done for, so you gotta... Eh. It's not very effective in Starly Fainton. All you have to do is lose, Gardenia. I've also gave my Pokemon plates that I found underground. So that's how my Pokemon have items. Really? I know Lion's electric attacks won't be able to hit Rose Rain, 
but his other attacks will be able to. No, super potion, darn you. Uh, okay, that's a critical. Maybe sparkle will do more than bite. Press now it's gonna be effective. Since my, since he's very big, I could probably do one more bite. Ah, poison sting! That doesn't have to destroy me. Oh, come on, it just destroy me. I'm now gonna get bugs out. Despite his weak form, I'm pretty sure he will be able to defeat Rose Raid. Okay, maybe not. We just have to keep waiting. Wanna just keep attacking Wimple. I just hope she doesn't have another another super potion stuff somewhere. It can't be a critical hit. Oh. I'm pretty sure Wimple is done for. Why not turtle? Razor leaves. Grass knot should do quite a bit. Grass knot's a really good attack. Too bad all our Pokemon have it. Stun Spore. I don't think that would do anything to Razor Leaf. Okay, maybe it will. Use Razor Leaf. I just really don't want to send out my other Pokemon. Because they're weak to grass. They don't really have a, a good strong against grass lineup. I'll tell you when this battle is over. I just won versus Gardenia. What do you want me to catch? That's Tepig. And plus, Tepig's not even in this game. Chimchar. And I didn't choose him. It's a gift from me. Ash and all the anime, but not all, most of the stories in between. What did you say? Yeah, Ash gets all his starters, except that that's not true. You can't get more than one starter in the games. Sadly, I wish there was a way to get a starter. Goodbye. Hello viewers, I'm going into the Team Galactic ability, and this guy has something very important to say. Welcome to Team Galactic. Are you here to donate your Pokemon? <laughs> it's funny how they always say that. When you, how that guy says that. I'm only invading here, your space, to get the Cycle Shop Manager back. I've already defeated all these people, so there's no need to re-battle them. And now I'm going to battle Jupiter. Safe. Nathan's whining about that he doesn't get his food choice because mom... 
because our mom doesn't want him to. Hey, did you want something? How silly of me to even ask. You want to feed the Pokemon. Yeah, that's gonna happen. She, it probably meant that, hey, as if that's going to happen. Instead of that's going to happen. Because then she's overconfident about herself. And I'm telling the truth. Oh, aerial battle. Too bad, Zubat. You got, you will get taken out very quickly. How ins insolent. Take a bite of this. Um, well, it's very, that's very appropriate. You use the move bite. Scun tank. I'm gonna switch to turtle. One of the main reasons I actually win these fights is because I have a team. Not just one high le up level Pokemon, Pokemon like I did with my old team. I'm gonna use Grass Knot on you. It is screech. Because it looks heavy. Oh gosh, I have effects aren't strong against him. I skunk tanks. He smokes cream. My accuracy fell, so I'll cut him. I'm just gonna keep cutting him. Poison gas? Oh no. That probably makes my guy poisoned. Now Nathan's whining in this room because he didn't get what he wanted. Now he's throwing stuff at me because he didn't get what he wanted. And he does know he's currently, this is going to go all over YouTube. <laughs> so now that my leader Pokemon got fainted, I have no choice but to take him out with Lion. Do your best roar, Lion. You spark. I should have used roar if he had roar. Spark was able to attack it. Oh no, smoke screen. Why do you keep doing this? Now it went to 90% accurate. Now I might faint Scun Tank. Use Bite. It is I to use Poison Gas. Oh man, it didn't do much. I'm hurt by poison. I'm pretty sure there's gun tank. Only attacking move is to poison me. That's why I keep using smoke screen, so. He's mainly relying on the poison. He knocked me out, so I could have just used my weakest Pokemon. This is a very head-to-head -head combat battle. Oh, it actually knows Night Slash too. So now I'm gonna get 
get bugs out to try and beat him. He's still a worm ball. Wow. One hit KO. Now I'm going to send out Otter. She just fell, which is very important for a water gun, especially in real life. Something tells me that's not going to hit in a long time. I'll tell you when I beat it, it's going to take just fainted. So Rocky will gain quite a bit of EXP. All the way up to level 16. Losing to some child being careless cost too much for me. Well, aren't you tough? It's okay though. Our official Pokemon statue investigation is finished. Why does it collect the energy from the valley wind works? We're pretty much finished here. Uh, I'll let you in on the low thing. Our boss is researching the myth of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical Pokemon, he will become the ruler of Sinnoh. As a test, you keep battle of Team Galactic's affairs from now on. But uh, this is your last warning. I got my Clefairy back at, and it's all thanks to you, but that Team Galactic. They said Clefairy came from space, handed over. The logic baffles me still. It's like they are from space. Anyway, they're gone now. Thank you very much. I can't thank you enough right now, but cruise by my cycle shop, okay? So, yes, I am going to your cycle shop. Team Galactic evacuated, it seems. So that's the last of them we're going to see. I'm going to go to the bicycling shop. Here it is. Thanks for asking me. This is something to show my thanks. The latest model bicycle. You must take it, I insist. As a latest model, sorry. Sorry. Press the B button to shift up or down. And third gear, you can't. Uh, you can't. You can't go all that fast. That's easier to control. The warp gear gets harder to steer. And stop lights fast. So goodbye.